Hey guys, I'm going to be showing you how to get Ubuntu 8.10 for free without using a disk. And to do this, um, open up your web browser, go to google.com, google.com, uh, type in Wubi, W-U-B-I. And there should be, you should click on the first one, which is Wubi Ubuntu installer for Windows. And Wubi, just click download now. Click on save file. Open it up. Hmm. Oops. Yeah, open it up and um, I clicked on it way too many times. Alright, so you'll come to here and choose what drive you want to save it in. What Whatever drive has the most uh, uh, memory. And installation size minimum 15 maximum 30 30 if like I I'd recommend 30 but 15 is just fine too but I'm just gonna choose 30 for this but I'm not actually gonna install it desktop environment Ubuntu language English or whatever language you speak username just pick on just pick any username you want because there's gonna be a login screen for it password I'm gonna use one two three for my example one two three install all right. Um, okay. After it's done. Okay. After it's done, it's gonna ask you to restart your computer. Okay. So when you restart your computer, you're gonna get this screen. Like, it's called the Windows Boot Manager screen. Like, once you start up, there's gonna be this Windows Boot Manager screen, and use your arrow keys to select Ubuntu 8.10, and you'll have it like, like, yeah. Because this is this is called dual booting, and the good thing is that um, you will be automatically like makes it dual boot accessible. So like you can either choose win to boot with Windows Vista or Windows XP or Windows Seven, or you can boot into Ubuntu, which is a cool thing. Or um, if you, you guys can check out some other videos on YouTube on how to create a partition, and yeah. It, they're all it's fine with this also all right thanks guys for watching i hope this helped you uh i hope this helped you please rate comment subscribe add me on skype add me as a friend on youtube personal message me for any problems with this or just request for a video and i'll i'll come up with some more tutorials all right bye